Hey, what's up YouTube? On one just released Photo Raw 2021 yesterday and it has a ton of new features. My name is Tom Cheswick and I'm a professional photographer that's been using On One for several years and I'm very ex excited about this new release. Here's a list of the new features. On One Portrait AI, it automatically analyzes each face and adds just the right amount of retouching to the skin, eyes, and mouth, giving professional results in no time at all. The new spot healing brush. It's not only faster than current tools, it maintains full non-destructive adjustments for each spot you remove. It has a replace color filter. It's perfect for tweaking or totally changing the color of eyes, flowers, buildings, or anything else. Custom brush shapes. Now you can choose from a variety of brush shapes like a cloud brush or even import your own. It has a color sensitive gradient mask, making it easier to mask. It also has smart organize so you can find and group photos that have similar appearance, location, or the time it was taken. It now has full screen preview. And now you can create quick slideshows that include user adjustable delays and an elegant dissolve transition. It now has batch HDR and pano. This is a huge time saver for real estate and landscape photographers. They brought back fill layers to set a background color for a composite layer. They have plugin support for Photoshop, Lightroom, Photoshop Elements, Apple Photos, Affinity Photo, and Corral Paint Shop Pro. Today we're going to download and install and set up and have a quick tour of On One Photo Raw. Please use my affiliate link listed below as it doesn't cost you anything to use it, but it will help me be able to continue to provide free content on YouTube. So let's visit the site, download it, and install the free 14-day trial version. Okay, so I just pasted in the affiliate link listed below, and we'll hit enter. It automatically brings you to the same page as if you went to onone.com. So what we're going to do today is try the 14-day trial version. So we're just going to click on try it for free. It's going to actually pop up with a window to enter your email address. I have already have, so that's why it's showing this. I have actually already downloaded to save a little time, so I'm going to go to my downloads folder. And we'll double click on the On One Photo Raw 2021. Okay, so we're just going to follow the steps and install. We'll click on continue, use the default location, install for all users, quickly read and accept. Okay, so I may cut out a little bit of this part while it's installing. Be sure to hit yes. Okay, the installer has completed, so let's go ahead and run On One Photo Raw 2021. If you're a longtime user of On One Photo Raw, right now it's migrating my data to the new version. It won't do this if you're new to On One Photo Raw. Okay, now that it's processed everything and it's ready for us to either sign in or start the 14 day trial or buy it. For now, let's start the 14 day trial. Put in your email address. Okay, so it opens up in the default browser mode and looking at our C drive, we could pick our desktop, our default location that we can set up 
different areas. One thing that I love about On One Photo Raw is it isn't like Lightroom where everything is cataloged. Um, so we can just go through and look through any of our hard drives. And without importing anything, any of our photographs are right there that we can access. Obviously, On One Photo Raw works with raw images. It does work well with JPEGs too. We're going to go up top, go to Edit, go to Preferences, make sure everything is set up. We do want to make sure that it checks for updates on launch. Under sidecar options, we want to make sure that this is checked to save the on one sidecar files. That means um, it saves that file right in the same folder as what we are editing. And that makes it easier to back up the files. So if we drag this folder into Dropbox or onto a thumb drive, or burn it to a DVD even, um, it is going to have all of our edits lo um, tied in to the folder that's being moved or copied. Okay, so that's good. Plugins, all this is good here. You can determine how much uh, of your system resources are being used by On One. You can tie it into different drives. Um, I don't use Microsoft OneDrive, so I'm going to disable that. Okay, and we'll take a closer look at this later, but everything looks just right for me. So I'm going to close this out. So this is perfect. It's very easy to edit images in On One. So On One Photo Raw has always been like Bridge and Photoshop combined. Adobe Bridge allows you to look through, organize um, your images. And then of course, Photoshop allows you to uh, tweak an image. So let's take a look at this. So again, we did not have to import any images. We have went straight to a folder. We'll double click on an image. So we can zoom in, see if that's something that we want to work on. And if it is, just go up to the edits tab and it takes us right into the develop module. Here we can tweak the exposure, contrast, highlights, any of the ones that you normally could do. It also though has A1 auto. So a lot of times that's a great place to start. It flattened it out a little bit, lowered the contrast. If I don't like that, you can override AI auto. Just double click on the word contrast. Next on top, we have develop. We have effects. So if we wanted to, we could look at quite a few different looks for this and they are all one click options. The nice thing is if it's too strong, you can dial back the effect by slip, simply dragging on the slider. Okay, after we get a look that we like, we can go straight into Portrait AI. Again, it uses artificial intelligence to analyze each of the faces. It applies skin retouching. We'll do a more in-depth tutorial on this. I just wanted to show you some of the features that the new On One 2021 program has. One of my favorite features is the local adjustment brushes. So this is where you can go in and um, tweak certain areas and just highlight those specific areas that you want where you can change exposure or even colors. So this was our quick tour. Thank you so much for downloading and installing 
on one photo raw 2021 i'm going to make more videos go in depth on each of the different settings for the develop effects portrait ai and local adjustments but this is a great place to start and again thank you for watching my video and there will be more to come please leave comments about what areas of on one photo raw 2021 you want to learn more about and i'll be sure to make videos about those Thanks again.